Welcome to another great topic. In this video, you will learn how to budget, save money, and pay off debt. If this is your first time here, my name is Unwana Udo. Every week, I share great content on personal finance and wealth creation. Make sure to consider subscribing to my channel if you find value here, don't forget to hit the notification bell so you never miss any new updates from me. I once heard someone say, earning more money is not the answer but how you use your money will determine your financial outlook in life. Are you part of the middle class or millionaires who live paycheck to paycheck? Having strong money management skills will help you use your money to live the life you want. You must have a plan for your money, and if you don't have a plan for your money, you will never win the game of personal finance. The key is to be disciplined, have goals, and the desire to achieve financial independence. Remember people out there are out to get your money through marketing tactics, it is your responsibility to be prepared to handle these real-life forces. How to budget money. A budget is the best way to become a saver. To create a budget, get your bank account statements, pay stubs, and other financial documents to figure out where your money is going and coming from. One method is to calculate your fixed expenses and then figure out your other needs such as food, gas, clothing, entertainment, and so on. Next, determine a number for your weekly expenses and stick to your budget. You can set a specific amount, such as $150 a week, take that out of your bank in cash at the beginning of the week. Use that money for the week and try not to dip into your other funds. You can then try to go down to $100 or $50 per week to see what you really need and what you can do without. Once you get used to living on a budget, you will free up more money for savings and paying off debt. You must use SMART when creating your budget where the S stands for specific, M stands for measurable, the A stands for achievable, R stands for relevant, and finally, the T stands for time-bound. You must make a budget that is realistic in order to succeed, yes you may strive to save 50% of your income every month, but depending on your fixed expenses, that may not be possible. If at all possible, use data from your previous year as a starting point to help you create your budget. Making a budgeting plan. The first section of any budget is the income section. You will start by adding up all your monthly income, after taxes, etc. This is basically your net take-home pay. Next, add up and itemize all your expenses. Some examples are, mortgage or rent, car payments, utilities, groceries, transportation, insurance, and so on, you get the idea. Money left over is total income minus total expenses. Hopefully, this is a positive number. Budgets can be cumbersome, therefore consider using a budgeting app. A budgeting app can remove some of the headaches of maintaining a budget on paper or a spreadsheet. There are many budgeting apps online, make sure to find one that integrates with your main checking account. Your credit and debit card purchases will automatically populate in the app, this will make your life easy. Budgeting isn't fun, using an app that does all the work for you is priceless. How to save money while budgeting. Here are some tips you can implement starting today. Number 1. Before making any purchase, make sure you compare prices and look for coupons and sales promotions. Number 2. Take the savings from tip number 1 and put it into a savings account, even if it is just a few dollars, they eventually add up. Number 3. Set up automatic deductions from your paycheck every time you get paid and put this in a savings account. Number 4. Set up a direct deposit from your paycheck into a savings account and plan your budget based on what is left. Number 5. Have your employer split your paycheck into your checking account and savings account, however, for the self-employed, schedule automatic transfers from your main checking account to your dedicated savings account on a consistent basis. Number 6. Use the money saved to pay off your debts quickly. If you need more information on how to pay your debts off quickly, I will leave a link at the end of this video, make sure to check it out. If you found value so far, hit the like button and share this video. Also, please smash that subscribe button if you haven't done so already, it is free to hit the subscribe button. Make sure to check the description below for a link to my latest personal finance course, Personal Finance Domination, I am sure you will find value here. Hurry and sign up while the price is still low and I look forward to seeing you there. Thank you for watching this video and, the next video on the screen contain information you will love, click to watch it now.